All right, what's up, everybody? Jason from Game Octane again. We're here at PSX. Uh, we're here with Dom. Uh, he's going to show us a little bit of this game called Flint Hook. I feel bad. I personally have not heard about it until recently. Uh, this game looks really fun. So, uh, Dom, go ahead and give us a little bit of uh, background about what the game is stuff about. Right. So you're playing uh, Flint Hook. Uh, you're a space pirate armed with a hook shot, so you can zip around the levels really fast. Uh, you also have a gun uh, that you can shoot 360 degrees and uh, slow-mo power that you can use pretty much uh, infinitely. Uh, and you're going into spaceships to steal gold and treasure and uh, fight uh, other pirates. And it's, uh, it's pretty sweet. <laughs> it's pretty sweet, of course. Pretty sweet, yeah. So this game looks really fun. It's got the nice, cool uh, pixelation look. Um, I got to play a little bit, Noel got to play a little bit of it, and it looks really fun. Um, what kind of uh, gameplay can people expect? Like how long, uh, what, what kind of level ups and stuff can you do over there? Right, so it's, uh, it's pretty much infinite because it's uh, procedurally generated. Uh, the levels are always different. Uh, we do make the rooms by hand, so it's 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 handcrafted content, even if it's randomized. Okay. Uh, and then the progress-wise, you uh, the more you collect gold, the more you uh, can buy some permanent upgrades. But you do lose a lot of stuff if you die. Okay. You do have to start over. Uh, so yeah, it's it's very much in the vein of Rogue Legacy or Spelunky games like that. Okay. Uh, but uh, well, there's a lot of replayability there. You yeah. basically play this game forever if you wanted to. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Yeah, I hope so. I hope, yeah, I yeah, hope play so. the game forever, you guys can pick this up. Yeah. Cool. And also, this game is hard to play while you speak. Yeah, I, <laughs> so you're doing well. You're doing better than what we were doing, so you're fine. Um, is PS4 the only console this game looks to be coming out on, or are you going to try to release uh, other We console? already announced uh, Xbox One, Steam, and PS4. Okay. Yeah. And, and when, when can someone expect to pick this game up? If not, if we're aiming for somewhere around March to May. Okay. Uh, so early 2017. Early 2017. That's cool. Yeah, if you guys, uh, he's been going through pretty quick, but there's a lot of mechanics where um, the gun is going to be your, one of your main weapons, but a lot of times you're not going to be able to shoot the actual enemies until you pop the bubble around them with the hook to get them. Um, and of course, collecting all the coins, get all the loot, uh, it's going to obviously be the best bet you have. Yeah, and you have a helmet that does little bubbles sometimes also. <laughs> So, also, you do have a map, kind of like a Metroid-ish map, where you kind of see where you've been, where you haven't been. I know Road Legacy and other games have that kind of map on it. Um, every, every level is basically a really small Metroidvania map. Uh, okay. It has this feel. Oh, this is great. All right, there you go. Uh, Flint Hook, pick it up, hopefully, between March and May of next year. Uh, stay tuned. I'm going to keep in touch with Dom and his team so we can make sure we get all the updates and get you guys up to date. Thank you again so much, man. Yeah, thank you. Much appreciated. Thank you.